COVID, climate change and Iran, a few of the pressing issues world leaders hammer out at the G20 summit in Rome. Also in Rome, Boris Johnson warns the EU that French threats over post-Brexit fishing licences are completely unjustified. We're going to get on uh, and do the things that matter to, to both of us and make sure that uh, we, we work together on tackling the, the big issues that face the world. Three people are killed in Sudan as hundreds of thousands protest on the streets against the military coup. Climate activist Greta Thunberg arrives in Glasgow hours before the start of the COP26 conference. And church bells ring out across the UK, sounding a warning about the dangers of climate change. So let's have a look at what the papers are saying this morning. Let's start with the front pages. And uh, COP26 features prominently on many of them. The Climate Summit is, quote, the world's moment of truth, according to the Scotland on Sunday. Uh, the paper carries a photograph of the activist Greta Thunberg arriving in Glasgow. The Observer reports that scientists and environmentalists have called for Boris Johnson and the French President Emmanuel Macron to end the row over Anglo-French fishing rights amid fears that it could overshadow the climate conference. And the fishing row also appears on the front page of the Sunday Telegraph. The paper reports that Mr Johnson has accused Mr Macron of participating in a pattern of threats against the UK.